Hello and welcome to Wonder. Some pretty good games here right lately. Uh, this one has some of the best players, especially probably focus on uh, Voodoo taking on Maverick, both playing EEF. Do have some really nice allies here in this top corner as well with uh, Shava and uh, Corwin. On the bottom, still very good players. Got Mercy Time and uh, Boiler, uh, both Seraphim taking on. Uh, our haunt and uh, evil mind, so EF and Seraphim. The EF Seraphim basically all, oh, actually, no, there's an AM player, a Corwin. Head in the back, Freshy versus Mirror Mirror and Aeon on Aeon battle. Absolutely no Cybern here. So we'll see what happens. The plan for Voodoo, a whole bunch of land factories, absolutely no air. Not too much power, looks like he's just gonna go with the Hydro, we'll plant some air later. A scout coming up, multiple scouts for Maverick. He's moving out with his ACU into the middle. Looks like Voodoo, before he moves out, he's going to pick up a factory. Also, scouts and flares for Corwin. And here, a group of Selenes coming down from Evil Mind. I run into some tanks. Selenes versus tanks. Selenes are going to die. We see a response from a Boiler as well. They're going to defend. That's uh, really one thing on this map. You don't want people to get behind you. You have uh, four players and three paths between the players where you can sneak by and start doing damage to engineers. It's a really big pain. Scout from Miramir. And here we do see a Selene that just snuck through for Eel Mind. Can uh, start creating problems against some of these engineers. Of course, uh, engineers, if they pay attention, they can reclaim. But there, there's a kill just before tank comes in and takes care of that problem looks like that's going to be the only successful raid from either side still have this aurora with a couple kills in the middle from uh, Corwin and Corwin's ACU also going into the middle, we also see Arhant and Corwin, both of them with ACUs, uh, quite uh, a distance from each other, Maverick and Voodoo meet each other for the first time here looks like Voodoo has a couple more units with him he's already sitting on the four line factories, now five and it's mostly tanks, it doesn't have, look like he's got too much artillery. Of course, Artie takes uh, two shots to kill by the ACU, while the, the tank takes three. Could be a significant difference. Maverick also has uh, quite a few land factories now working on an uh, air factory as well. It's going to have a total of five, uh, six land and air. We already see six land, seventh coming up for Voodoo. Now we did see Miramir come in. This is the back player. It's going to help Maverick out against Voodoo. We see Corwin moving uh, sideways as well. Looks like Xiao's ACU is the one that's missing here, but it, once he comes there, it's going to be 3v2. Freshy sitting back at base with the ACU. That could be a significant difference. More ACU is up top, especially at the Tech 1 stage. Could make the difference. Evil Mind getting an upgrade. We also see Mercy Time. He's already got the gun. Going to the middle, got a nice Tech 1 force. We might see a, see a battle. And Boiler and uh, Ar not, uh, Arhant uh, just looking at each other. Uh, Sava has got the double gun here at minute 5. And that's very significant. Now yeah, this is actually Anne and Anne. Corwin's still working on some upgrades. Voodoo, uh, halfway on his health, 6 skills. Getting a pretty large force, but he's going to be taking on two different uh, ACUs. Maverick getting an upgrade, they're getting some help from Miramir, but Artie from Voodoo targeting uh, Maverick's AC actually forcing him to cancel that upgrade. Good stuff from Voodoo. Meanwhile, Siava, that's why he stayed in the back for so long. He got that double gun, and now he's just going to be rolling through. Could be trouble. Evil Mind and the Mercy Time, both with guns. Very similar forces here. And uh, Arahant uh, moving through. Boiler with Tech 2. And Sava just rolling through 13 kills, and nothing to stop him. Straight through the middle. He's actually going to be focusing on the bottom. We do see Voodoo with a very significant land force. He's got a big Tech 1 land spam, and actually two engineers and power spam as well. And so far, uh, Boiler having to retreat, losing position in the middle, completely taken over. But here comes. Voodoo, together with uh, Corbin, has got Tech 2. He's making Tech 2 point defense. They might try to cut Siava off. 
but he's got a nice uh, place to retreat to, which uh, which is Boiler's base. Meanwhile, Evil Mind and Mercy Time very much a uh, well, actually maybe a slight advantage for Evil Mind. And now we're seeing uh, Seva getting cut off from his base by Voodoo's units. Still a nice stream from Arhant, who's getting some tech too. Tech to point defense and a shield. This is a big good place for Seva to retreat to with 47 kills. And that's a nice shield to have. So Voodoo kind of sliding across, trying to play defense. Meanwhile, tech to point defenses between Maverick and Corwin. Corwin getting some TMD as well. Looks like Maverick has a whole bunch of... Um, mobile missile launchers and tech to point defenses it's exactly what you need for a tech two point defense standoff but here comes Voodoo's units he's also getting an ACU upgrade and that really nice push from Seva is going to be fortified by uh, Arhant's uh, tech two point defense and shield meanwhile Boiler is looking to break that shield with some tech two point defense of his own as well as nice stream of tech one units but it'll be difficult against the upgraded ACU 765 kills boiler and mercy time trying to solve this problem actually kill, take out the shield Sava 70 kills our haunt uh, should work on a new shield if he if they have uh, any hope of holding on to this place although three ACUs versus two very even battle meanwhile Corwin Tech to point defenses and TMDs. It's a very nice TMD against large amounts of units, but you can't overwhelm it. Voodoo uh, sliding across to help out his uh, team. He's already got some Tech 2, some shields, some Tech 2 flak. He's got his Tech 2 factory, the AC at Tech 2 getting some Tech 2 power. A couple of Tech 2 uh, mass extractors as well. We haven't looked at the back players for a while. Freshy kept his ACU in the back to do a little more uh, eco. He's got tech to air that he's spamming. We are seeing Mercy's uh, ready for Miramar. So if uh, somebody wanders off a little too far with their ACU, they're going to be in danger. Sava retreating. 90 kills. Voodoo making his presence really felt here on the bottom. Meanwhile, Maverick is going to have two shields. Corwin uh, having some problems trying to get a shield up. A lot of uh, mobile missile launchers from uh, Maverick putting a lot of pressure. Miramar getting an upgrade. Tuck to point defense in Savas base. So very much a, a deadlock in the middle. Can't really say which team had an advantage, but one thing that's significant is the Freshies economy. He's really uh, hasn't particip participated in this battle. He's been taking this whole time. Meanwhile, Merrimer did uh, get himself involved. And here's uh, the Air Force from Fresh. He's going to take over air directly above Merrimer's factory. He's going to make some flak to try to uh, get the Swift Twins away. But this could be very dangerous for the top side. Losing air, like especially with uh, Aeon. We might see Mercy. There's actually some Tech 3 mass extractors coming up for fresh so he's really running away with this one. Maverick having uh, to defend against the Tech 1 uh, push from Voodoo, but uh, he is going to survive. Corwin trying to rebuild his Tech 2 point defense. And on Mercy time, uh, making a push, Evil Mind will stop that from happening. He's going uh, to get some Ilshavas, a lot of kills on us. Yoshavas, Boiler, Stealth, and uh, Tech 2 shield. Of course, Seraphim are extremely good at these battles at Tech 2, but eventually UEF does take over Tech 3 point defense. But a combination of Seraphim and UEF is really the best. And that's exactly what Evil Mind and Arhant have here. Seraphim shields and Tech 3 point defense, uh, as good as it gets. Sava helping out with some Tech 2 point defense from Maverick. And TMD doing its thing, deflecting missiles. And Maverick spread really well. It's a really nice choice of units. I actually go on tech 3 with land. But these mobile missile launchers causing a lot of problems. Voodoo now with the shield, tech 2, and the gun. Making a push together with a whole bunch of tech 1, tech 2. See Maverick uh, losing some of his shields. Sava retreating. 
mobile shields to help out for Voodoo from uh, Corwin. And Maverick in full retreat. He's got mobile missile launchers and actually he's Mercy's now from Freshy. Maverick uh, going down to 2000 health. That's very dangerous. Freshy makes his presence known but looks like there are some mercies from Miramir as well. Sava is still full health. Voodoo about to lose his entire shield. He's been taking on a lot of tech two point defenses. 28 kills Mavericks trying to get a shield. It's very important that he gets that. His ACU is quite vulnerable. On the bottom here, still very much uh, deadlocked. That was a nice push from Voodoo with that shield at ACU. Allowing Corwin to make a push. Just going to get some shields. Some nice teamwork. Of course, Maverick did save most of his mobile missile launchers with that retreat. He will put a lot of pressure on this freshly built base. And Tech 3 Air now from Miramir. Tech 3 Air 4 fresh as well. Nearly done with his Tech 3. He's already got double RAS in his ACU. Extremely good economy for Freshy. Which means he can, uh, I mean, power is really what you need to make a lot of uh, plants. And he's got a lot more than what Miramir has. Miramir, using his ACU in battle, does not have any RAS, so that's an extra 5,000 power that Freshy has. Voodoo uh, is about to get his shield back. He's pushing up 38 kills. Also, some Tech 3 uh, land from uh, Siava. He's got the anti shield weapon. Which is interesting how good that is, is going to be against the uh, shielded ACU. But we did see some mercies against Voodoo. And it appears that, yeah, it's causing a lot of damage uh, to that shield. The Absolver, a very nice choice. You can see Voodoo lost his shield extremely quickly. And now here's a push. A whole bunch of uh, Tech 2, the Ilshavus from uh, Evil Mind. He's going to try to cut uh, Voodoo and Corwin off from their bases. But we do see a response with Tech 2 and Tech 3 from um, Boiler. So nice try there from Mercy, but the opposite player take care, takes care of the problem. And uh, it looks like our hunt is going to go with Tech 3, and we're going to see a Tech 3 point defense push here on the bottom. Tech 3 from uh, Siava. A whole bunch of uh, Harveys. It would be tragic to see them get overcharged here. And that's exactly what they're asking. Uh, asking for that was three Harveys in one shot from Voodoo and there goes the fourth yeah Harveys versus ACUs is just uh, dangerous and here comes Strat Bombers from Freshy there goes uh, the shields are almost dead total air domination by Freshy more Strat Bombers you gotta get those shields up as quickly as possible and take two gunships as well Harbys coming in, uh, sabotaging the shield production. Maverick may be the first player to die in this one. And he gets sniped by Freshy. And of course Maverick uh, says GG. Voodoo uh, continues to push, but he couldn't get himself in a lot of trouble. Pushing into a lot of shields. There goes uh, Sava. Another kill for Freshy. Total domination by Freshy. That's that's what happens when you play back play some city for a while. He can make that eco really count with the tech three units, tech three air. Miramir really no hope and now Miramir just found himself inside a base that just disappeared. He's absolutely undefended. And now Voodoo Corwin might choose to push. Miramir is gonna retreat back to his base and all this free mass. This looks like some snipers. Who's got the snipers? This Ilsha is really trying to run away, but it's stuck. It really needs to run away. Actually, it's, uh, it belongs to Evil Mind. And now here come the Tech 3 point defenses from Arhant. And the bottom side, finding this up with no UEF, are going to be in trouble. Now Miramir also throws in the towel. Massive scout from. Uh, Fresh. It looks like Miramir just disconnected. That's why we uh, we got that dissync. Like to ask people to please uh, exit through the score screen so that replays aren't ruined like this. 
but this game is basically over with Freshy showing that some city sometimes win ga wins games but we really got to give credit for uh, his uh, front four players who were able to fight a 4v5 in terms of ACUs did a very good job did see Voodoo on Corwin take on three ACUs here this on the bottom here is just basically deadlocked until we saw the tech three point uh, defenses from uh, our hunt here come tech three land and uh, this is basically over should see some of these strat bombers put an end to this uh, desync voodoo pushing up 83 kills Yeah, evil mind are on to stealth shields take three onto air take three point defense not wanting to die see how quickly you can make strat bombers each one of those is about 2000 mass I believe yep Voodoo 114 kills rolling into uh, Arhan's base. And here comes a chicken from Mercy Time. And he's gonna here minute 27 end the game. So hopefully people enjoyed this one.